Snow is on the way, but do you need a warm place to go? Christina Benzel shows you where to get warm. Raynard Mullane finds warmth here often <laughs> at Milwaukee's Repairers of the Breach. I look forward to uh, coming here, staying warm, getting out of the cold. As the temperatures drop, the need for a warm place rises. According to the Milwaukee Continuum of Care, two places are designated as a warming center, St. Benedict's and Repairs of the Breach. We're able to handle the, the crowd and we're able to open the doors and we're able to save those lives. The Continuum of Care Grant Compliance Manager tells Fox 6 they aren't advertising the other four locations. That's because they hope more people will utilize the 211 line. It's the referral number for anyone looking to access a warming shelter. This also helps with safety so people don't show up unannounced with potential to spread COVID and the flu. This is just the beginning. <laughs> Repairs of the Breach Executive Director James West says they hit a record number of people already. The cold temps hit before warming centers were open citywide. I think it just caught a lot of people off guard. And once I realized that uh, the temperatures was going to dip like they did, um, I, I panicked myself, to be honest. As the temperatures ahead are chilling, the doors are open here. If you happen to see somebody who is sleeping outside in the cold or you know somebody who needs a place to stay this winter, the best thing you can do is call 211. Reporting in Milwaukee, Christina Van Zelst, Fox 6 News. Christina, thank you. If you are looking for a place to stay warm, you can also get an in-person assessment at both downtown locations. But St. Benedict's is not staffed yet.